They're the latest area fire department to create a dive rescue team. And the joint Nina Menasha Fire Department has been set to fill a coverage gap on Lake Winnebago, but the team has needed some private money to get into the water, and Fox 11's Chad Doran explains this evening why a fundraiser could be the final donation needed. The number of water rescues on Wisconsin's largest lake is on the rise in recent years. Since uh, the Nina Menasha Fire Department's consolidated back in 2003, we've seen about a five to six hundred percent increase in the number of calls. It's the driving force behind this golf fundraiser to help the department's efforts to create a rescue dive team. The 10th annual Nina Mayor's golf outing is expected to raise more than $5,000 toward the $90,000 goal. The team had already raised more than $80,000 and began training last year. There's always what they call the golden hour, of trying to get somebody out from underneath the water and getting resuscitation done within that first hour. While golfers are out on the course making putts to save par, the fundraiser will help the fire department be ready for a save they hope they never have to make. With the addition of the Nina Menasha dive team, Lake Winnebago will have nearly complete coverage in the event of a water or ice rescue. Dive teams are also stationed in Oshkosh and Fond du Lac, covering the west and south sides of the lake, while Fond du Lac also covers parts of the eastern shore. The Calumet County dive team, formed in 2010, has dive teams stationed in the town of Calumet, Stockbridge, and the town of Harrison, covering the northern and eastern sides of the lake. The more teams we have in place, the better off that those resources can get out there and, and hopefully make a difference. And that's, that's the end goal. To help make each incident a rescue instead of a recovery. In Nina, Chad Doran, Fox 11 News. The team says it expects to be ready to go in about a month.